I'm at the house at 25535 Mill Pond in the Lexington Woods subdivision. I'm going to give you 360 of the neighborhood here. This house is on a cul-de-sac. This is an established neighborhood, lots of mature trees. The house itself is got four bedrooms. Here we go to the front. Mature trees in the front. Take a look inside. This house has a single story, four bedrooms, two full baths. Let's head inside here. Got nice brick exterior. Okay, let's lay out the floor plan as we open the door here. Okay, pointing to the left is going to be three of the bedrooms. Straight ahead, back past the sliding glass doors, the patio. Around the corner is going to be the family room. Got a wet bar, another bedroom, and kitchen. So let's start here in the front. We got uh, ceramic tile front. Nice laminate floors here in the living room and family room area. Both start on the right here, nearest to us. Tile floors, this is the kitchen. We got an eat-in area. Uh, as you can see that uh, kitchen island has a long overhang, so you can put some stools under there, use that as another eating area. Um, you can put a, a seat cushion there for bench seating. Here's your fixture, you put your table here. Got a nice flat top stove, built-in microwave. You can see that overhang here as I kind of lower it there. There's your ice maker connection for your uh, refrigerator. You got your dishwasher. It's a nice, uh, nice wide kitchen here. There's going to be a pantry. Next to that, we have a coat closet. This would be bedroom number two. It's a good size, deep bedroom. Got your closet, ceiling fan, blinds, and nice neutral colors. This is about 11 by 14, so it's a good size bedroom. Much larger than average. Here we got nice uh, cathedral ceilings going all the way up to the top there. This can be your living room. Get your cable connection there. And then to the right we have a wet bar. Around the corner here, we're gonna have your, this could be your uh, family room area or you can also make this maybe a formal dining area if you want a formal dining. We got a wood burning stove, a uh, wood burning fireplace. Out here we have a covered patio. It looks like it's screened in to prevent bugs from getting at you. Um, let's take a quick look outside. Can see through the fence, uh, the screen here. Fence yard, nice mature trees. Some nice plants back here. So we got four sides brick on this house. Okay, I'm gonna head over here. We'll end up at the uh, master's last. So this is a very wide area here. Hallway bath. Got your tub and uh, shower combination there. Commode. There's the uh, shower head. All right. Right next to that, we'll, here we have bedroom number two. Let's see, out of the two, this is probably the smallest of the four bedrooms. It's still, you know, average size bedroom. Still, still use, definitely usable size here. 
Then we have some good closet space. This would be this is a larger bedroom also. Ceiling fan. So we got a total of four bedrooms. Uh, account master bedroom is number one. The, the first bedroom we saw next to the kitchen number two. Number three and number four. If I miscounted that. So that's four bedrooms. And then we have the utility area, tile. Washer dryer hookups. And then we have a two car garage with a garage door opener and your water heater. All right, so let's go to the Masters. Masters is large size, about 20 feet by about uh, 14 feet across, 12, 14, 12 to 14 feet, it kind of has a, um, an area that starts out here, so a little bit uh, hard to measure the whole room. But definitely a big area, you can fit a lot of furniture, king size bed, you have lots of room, you could probably even put a small desk here, have a little in, in uh, room office there. Got laminate floors, we've got two uh, mirrored closets. So each person have their own closet and it's kind of unique here. We got the dual sinks. We got um, no separation between them. We have the, oh, we got two showers. Okay, so we got a shower and tub combination. And then we have, here we can see the part of the closet space here. But then we also we have another um, commode and then another, another shower. So you got two separate showers and a bathtub. That's pretty unique there. So if you'd like more information about this home or like to schedule a showing, you can call us toll free at Liberty Management at 855 area code. And then the phone number is 347-3761. Thank you.